Zach's Rank Buys, stocks with a short-term buy or strong buy recommendation. And now, here are more Zach's Rank Buys. We're going to get the lowdown now on a couple of momentum stocks with Mike Vodica, our momentum stock strategist here at Zach's.com. Uh, you've got a Lulu of a one, this first one here. Yes, I do. <laughs> um, pronounced Lulu Lemon Athletica, L-U-L-U, the ticker symbol. What in the world do they do? This is a company that specializes in high-end yoga and athletic apparel. Okay, I knew that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it's a fairly niche market. The company hasn't even really been around that long. They've been around since 1998, but they've grown very quickly, a uh, market cap of $3.2 billion. And really the story right now is that this company is posting huge, huge growth numbers. That might come as kind of a surprise because we are in a weak consumer environment, but they're focused on a more of an affluent uh, consumer base, so that's served them well. Mm -hmm. uh, we saw uh, Q Q3 results in early September that were excellent. Uh, revenue was up 56% to $152 million year over year. And earnings came in at 30, cent, or 30 cents per share, which was 25% ahead of the Zach's consensus estimate. Uh, the company is in a very strong growth stage right now. They've got about uh, 125 stores. They're looking to add 25 new stores next year. And they're generating so much free cash flow right now that they're actually able to fund their growth uh, organically without having to borrow. So that means they've got a really great balance sheet. Yeah. Uh, they've got $178 million in cash, and they have no debt. So that's an enviable position for any company to be in, particularly a retailer. Sure. Uh, we've seen some pretty nice movement in estimates off the good quarter. Um, the current year added seven cents to a dollar twenty-two, and then the next year estimate is up five cents to a dollar forty-eight, and that's a twenty-one percent growth projection. So the longer-term picture looks nice too. Um, the valuation picture here does look a little bit pricey, but that's not totally uncommon for a company that's in the early stages of a growth cycle like this company is. All right. uh, trading at thirty-eight times versus uh, its pure average of seventeen, so a little bit pricey. Um, and then on the chart here, we recently saw a new all-time high at $48. Shares have been trending higher for about the last 18 months, and they've got some really great upward momentum right now. All right. And then there is Rand Gold Resources, G-O-L-D, ticker symbol. And I uh, guess you don't need a degree to <laughs> guess what industry that's in. No, you don't. Uh, this is a gold company, and uh, they mine in uh, West and Central Africa. So it's a little bit of an international flavor there. Uh, and the company has a $9.5 uh, billion market cap, so a little bit bigger. And this is just a pure play on what's going on with gold prices right now. Mm -hmm. This is a story that I'm sure most viewers are familiar with. Uh, we recently saw gold almost hit $1,400. It's been showing huge gains recently on the back of a lot of things that the central banks are talking about with uh, you know, quantitative easing and monetizing the debt. So a lot of investors are turning to gold to you know, sort of get hedged up against the, inflation, the threat of inflation. Um, this company's Q2 results are really strong. Uh, they came down the line in early August. Um, they posted a really solid 41% earnings surprise. And the, the metric that I wanted to point out to everyone is that their cost to uh, bring gold to the market is, is $650, $655 per ounce. Uh, over the quarter, their average realized price in the market was 1,109. So that's a really big spread between those two numbers. Mm -hmm. So as we continue to see gold go higher, the company will be more profitable, of course. Okay. Um, got a great balance sheet, um, cash positions up $267 million to $487 million from last year. Um, they basically have no debt, they've got about a million dollars, so it's marginal. Um, we've seen some nice movement in estimates here, uh, estimates are charging higher. The next year estimate is projected 144% growth, wow. so again, longer term picture looks solid. Uh, valuation, a little pricey, but that's not uncommon, again, for these kind of more uh, glamorous stocks right now. Uh, it's trading at 55 times forward versus a uh, pure average of 34 times. And then the last piece of the puzzle here, yep. the chart. Uh, we recently saw a new all-time high at $106, and the uh, company looks really strong right now. All right. Do you own either of these two? Uh, no, I don't. If you want to check out more Zach's Rank by Stock Pick Ideas, go to our homepage, zacks.com. We put four new Stock Pick Ideas up for you there daily, one in each of the investing categories written about on zacks.com, Mike's category, momentum included. With Mike Vodica, I'm Terry Ruffalo.